morning ladies and gents, it is 10 to 1. Um, we have just arrived at Derby Into and we've just come here to do a bit of shopping. We're going to see what sales they've got on um, because obviously there's, there's still going to be the Boxing Day sales. We've got Millie here with us. Um, just going to go for a wander today. Probably won't be here for too long um, because we're not very great with spending too much time shopping. Um, so yeah, just sit back and enjoy the video. Smash the little button. Say it. Huh? I'm going to finish it. Smash the little button and... What is it? Today we are repping the new outfit by the look of Chris off the sister. Needed a new bag and she spoiled me with an outfit bag. Fresh. Oh. <laughs> right, so a very successful shopping trip. Managed to buy myself a new jumper, which is actually quite fresh from Top Man. Bought myself two new t-shirts, kind of nice ones going out ones because I don't have many nice tops to wear. Um, and I also bought an All Saints t-shirt, long sleeve t-shirt in the sale, 20% off. It's beautiful, it's going to be our New Year's outfit. We also grabbed ourselves a Greg sausage roll because it just can't go wrong with Greg sausage roll. Mm. <laughs> and I haven't had lunch yet. Right, good morning ladies and gents, it's the following day, I just grabbed myself a haircut. Time is currently... 10 past 9, meaning that I was at the hairdressers for 8 o'clock. Um, so I was literally sat at the bar, I was getting my hair cut like, falling asleep. Um, but anyway, we're back home now, I'm going to get changed, I'm going to hit up the gym. However, today we're going to try the 3D energy drink. Um, so I'm going to do a little review for you. Obviously, you guys know that I used to drink White Monsters all the time. Um, and they were literally my favourite drink for a very long time. Um, so I'm going to kind of be comparing that to the White Monster. Kind of see where is the 3D energy drink on the market and how good it is compared to all the other energy drinks as well. Uh, Becca's going to be trying it with me as well. Bearing in mind I haven't had caffeine in months. And the last time I had a Monster I was off my rocker. Uh, so it's going to be interesting to see how I feel in the gym as well. Hopefully the drink's going to be really nice. I'm going to try the blue. I think it's blue raspberry. Blue. The blue drink anyway. Um, so I'm going to try that for now. Right, so Christian Guzman's 3D Energy Drink Company. If this sounds good, then it's a good start. Oh, yo. Right, moment of truth. I'm actually a little bit nervous. It smells good. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, we'll try that. What does it taste like? Kind of like the white monster. It just tastes exactly the same as a white monster. Yeah. A bit nicer. Ratings. I'll give that a solid. Mm -hmm. Nine and a half. Not quite perfect, but it's good. Also, I didn't leave it in the fridge. I left it in my cupboard, um, so it's kind of warm. Um, so maybe if it was cold, it might have been an absolute 10. Um, yeah, this is really good. I used to drink White Monster all the time, and this tastes pretty much, well, like Becca said, very, very similar. Um, they taste pretty much the same, don't they? Um, so yeah, slightly review. Nicer. Slightly nicer. Slightly nicer. Slightly nicer. I'm keeping the bottle anyway because it's a nice bottle. These bottles are absolutely beautiful. And that crack, that crack was good. Beautiful! Right, let's head to the gym and train chest and arms. So, we'll Go catch you there. Goodbye! Hello ladies and gents, welcome back to another commentary. So I'm just going to talk through my incline bench um, as I've got a couple of things to talk about. So. I've been a little bit on and off with my incline bench, um, so I since I switched from bench to incline bench because I want to work more on my upper chest um, because I feel like my upper chest is lacking. Um, my strength has kind of gone through the roof, um, and recently I've been doing a lot more dumbbell incline press. If I'm not training with someone, I don't have a spot, um, and incline dumbbell press is a lot more easy to do if you don't have a spot. Um, because if you can't lift the weight, obviously you can just drop the weight on the floor, whereas incline, you're obviously a bit buggered if you can't lift the weight because it's just going to drop onto you. Um, so recently I've been a little bit on and off of it, I haven't been as consistent as I wanted to be. Um, so today I kind of went into the workout knowing that my strength wasn't going to be there. 
um, and obviously I haven't trained for about four days uh, over the Christmas period because yesterday I actually tried to go to the gym um, and I got there at about 10 to 8 and then I got into the gym and they said yeah it's closing in 10 minutes um, because I didn't actually realise that the Christmas times were closing um, at 8 o'clock but anyway um, here I'm hitting five sets of five reps on 80 kilos on incline. Sometimes it's good just to drop it down, um, get a feel of the weight again, get back into it. Um, and that was kind of the plan for today. Um, so not doing anything too heavy, um, just getting the feel of the weight again. Um, and then I'm going to start building it back up again as we get into the new year, uh, we get back on the bulk. Um, so yeah, this is the current strength for the incline bench. Um, I want to hit 100 kilos for a single very soon. Um, I've attempted it twice before, failed it twice, um, and I also want to hit 110 um, flat bench as well. Um, so this will all come. This will all be coming very soon. Um, so yeah, this is a, this is 80 kilos, five sets of five reps. Uh, so yeah, enjoy the rest of the video. <laughs> Big boy weights. Oh, look at them. The uh, 1.25 and the 2.5. Massive weights they are. Versus Thomas's little puny weights. He's got the uh, 10 and the 20. Try and make y'all comfortable. That's right. For the record, you ain't trying to grow any stuff for you. That's right. For the record, lab on me going all the way. For the record, ain't trying to link no time to wish. Right, so workout complete. I'm gonna give you like an honest physique update. Uh, so post Christmas update, I literally haven't showed you my kind of bulking physique yet. Um, I was pretty much I only post the like, shredded pictures on Instagram. So this is basically the current physique. I'm pretty chunky. Right now, I just flip the camera. Around. So this is post kind of chest and arm workout. Um, looking pretty. This is definitely the biggest I've ever been, the heaviest I've ever been. Um, so we're heading in the right direction. Uh, so yeah, this is the current physique, nothing special, just pretty chunky if I'm honest. Right, so that is the workout complete. Uh, pretty intense workout, so it was really good. Then we hit our 5x5 five five to start with, 80 and 5x5, five five, so we're going kind of light. Um, we then did three more exercises for the chest, then we did about four, uh, three to four exercises for arms as well. Um, so really good intense workout. Got Becca here, um, pushed her really hard today. It's bloody boiling in the gym today, it was sweaty, like proper sweaty. Update on the caffeine. Um, it's supposed to feel all right, like, it, I, haven't, I haven't really been hit that hard by the caffeine today. Um, probably because I trained pretty hard and um, I didn't really notice it. Um, but definitely got me through the workout. 
I'm slightly worried I'm going to get back into caffeine now because I didn't feel that bad after that um, and I really do enjoy it that much. Um, so yeah, didn't feel too bad today. Really enjoyed the drink. The drink was really, really nice. Um, so most likely we'll be buying more of them because you can actually order crates off the internet now because they're basically set up with Predator Nutrition, which is like a EU distributor. Um, and you can buy like crates of, I think 20 for like 25 pound or something. Um, so yeah, probably might do that. So yeah, really good workout with Becca. I'm gonna head home now, edit up this video so far. If you're enjoying the video so far, please smash the thumbs smash, up button. Smash that I can't speak. Smash please the smash button. the thumbs up button. Um, so yeah. <laughs> right, so this is gonna sit proudly here. No one's gonna touch it. It's not moving anywhere. Beautiful. Right, so we've just watched Millie's brother play a bit of footy. <laughs> that face tells all. <laughs> Millie got too cold, too windy apparently. Um, so we're driving over, we're literally there for like 10 minutes. Hell yeah. Yeah. Come on, swag way. We have some cake. Some cake. Hell yeah. Look what it is cutting. Victoria sponge. Right, so it's half ten. It's time for a slice of cake. And some foam beads, you know. Got the slime. This is how you make slime, you know. You put, just put the Louis, water Louis in there. thinking it's hard. I'm going to say great. the slime. <laughs> no, what do you mean? Oh, we've got the tripod. Hey, you. I've got some great. Oh, they're soft. Oh, they're nice. It's good. Nice. Hell yeah, it's good. Stop doing that. Why? Yeah. Hell yeah. Embarrassing. Hell yeah. I've, got, I've got to look more interesting in my vlogs too. Hell yeah. Man. Oh, making it soften up. 15 seconds. Bam. Whoa. Oh, it's nice, soft. Go on, then have a bite. Okay. Where would you get down? Mm. Well, let's see the inside. Is it good? Yeah. Right, we're just finishing up the day watching Max Tuning's vlog. I'm going to get some sleep now and then train tomorrow um, with George. So I'll catch you. So I'll catch you tomorrow. Good morning, ladies and gents. It's the following day. I'm just sat chilling, editing up the video and watching some football. Um, so I'm actually going to wrap up this video here. Um, so on Monday, it's going to be New Year's Eve. So Tuesday is going to be the New Year 2019. I'm mad that it's come around so quick. Um, so I hope everyone has a really good New Year. I hope everyone enjoys their time with the family and friends or whatever they're doing. Um, so I'll be doing like a compilation of the whole year. Uh, probably for Wednesday at 4 o'clock, so that'll be the Wednesday 4 o'clock video. Um, so look out for that, hopefully it'll be a really good one, because a lot has happened this year. Obviously the YouTube channel has blown up this year. I've literally gained 3,200 subscribers this year alone. Um, so it's been a really good year. All down to you guys, so thank you very much for that. Um, so I hope everyone has a really good year. I'll catch you on Wednesday at 4 o'clock. So thanks so much for watching the video guys, make sure you smash the button. Oh, excuse me, make sure to subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I'll see you next time. Subscribe to Thomas Roundtree, legend. <laughs>